every vegetable uh, fruit out there has wild yeast floating around, it's everywhere, it's in the air. What you can do with this is ferment that yeast with sugar and water and whatever other flavours and put it in a bottle and it will carbonate. So you'll end up with a fizzy drink. So what I served you today was an elderflower, which is a classic English um, drink. They call it elderflower champagne. I call it elderflower fizz because the whole you know, champagne thing would mean it's from champagne, which is not. And basically, very, very simple process. Um, you warm up some water, you put some lemon juice in it, some sugar, and some elderflowers, which appear in spring and have the most amazing flavour. But you know, you could make fizzy lemonade the same way if you put lemons in. And um, you let that sit for a day, and then you put it in bottles and cap it, or put them in you know, old soft drink bottles, and sit it in a warm place and let it ferment and carbonate and then stick it into your fridge and it's this wonderful, you know, homemade soft drink.